Ben Hill, what's happening? All right, y'all. So we're currently in Wisconsin, and uh, yeah. <laughs> so we're currently in Wisconsin. We're about to get our day started. About to go in. Pause, 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 baby. You look amazing. Wow. I'm just looking at the camera. I'm like, dang. Thank you. Sheesh. <laughs> so mm. I took my hair. <laughs> I took my hair out, so this is my natural hair. I blow dried it last night. A lot of y'all ask about my hair. I keep it in that style a lot out here because it's just easy for me to maintain. As y'all can see, I can go months without even having to do my hair. And yeah. It's a, it's a potential. A few hours later. All right, y'all. So we just have officially parked for the day. We are now in Kentucky. We weren't able to do the video earlier like we wanted to because, I mean, Bae just been driving all day. And it's kind of hard for him to focus and talk when yeah. we're trying to record and while he's driving and the truck is just super loud. But anyways, anyways. We are now going to share the moment everyone has been waiting for. The story of my life. Oh. <laughs> You're extra. The story of how we first met. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into it. You feel me? Alright, so. Get into it, babe. Alright, so. Me. I'm going to give y'all timelines of what's going on. So in 2015, your boy went and got his license. You feel me? My CDLs. He ain't new to this. He true to this. You feel me? <laughs> 2015, I got my license. Right, so I was driving over the road for two years. Uh, at the time, it was just me and my dog. We was traveling, seeing different states. And I just remember, uh, at times, I would be feeling lonely. Away from family. You know, being away from friends. You know, just not having a social life. So I would talk to God a lot and be like, man, Lord... <sighs> I had no social life, you know what I'm saying? I ain't really, like, what we doing, you know? You're 21 at the time. Yes. And, you know, I felt like I just needed to come back in the city. So I ended up calling dispatch, and I told her, like, hey, look, you know, I need a social life. Um, I'm just going to, like, go find work in the city or whatever, you know. And she understood. She was like, okay, I understand you're young. You want to... You know, you still want your social life, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, all right, cool. So that's when I ended up meeting the beautiful Mila in 2017. Our friend was hosting a, a little get-together party. And we ended up, I ended up going there. And that's when I met you. And... But we were just cooling because he had a girlfriend at the time. Yes. So we weren't really looking at each other that way. I mean, I was. I thought he was fine or whatever. <laughs> and he took me home that night and yeah so that was the first time we've ever met shout out to our friend ja <laughs> for low-key putting us on but yeah he was holding a get together and me and jermaine we clicked immediately each time that we ran into each other we yeah. just clicked but like he said he had a girlfriend so it wasn't really on no flirty vibes i mean no it wasn't it wasn't we were just uh, just cool playing we playing monopoly spades like just Uno. hanging out yeah. yeah and he actually ended up taking me home that night because ja was like hey bro can you uh drop her drop her off at home because i didn't have a car at the time so he dropped me off at home fast forward all the way to 2018 i'm throwing myself a cabin party i'm turning 22 and i was like you know what i ain't never do nothing this big i want to go all out so I invite all my friends and I was like, you know, I want a DJ, but I got no DJ money. So our homeboy Ja was like, oh, um, my boy Jermaine could DJ for you. And so that's when we officially exchanged numbers. Mm -hmm. So now we have each other's phone number. And at that time, you know what I'm saying, we I was DJing on the ops, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, None yeah, of yeah. No. None <laughs> of this. But we DJing on the ops. But yeah, I just wanted somebody to be in control of the music pretty yeah. much. Um, hold on, hold on. So let me say this. 
So I remember us getting on the phone. We was talking about different types of music. Yeah. You wanted Afro beats. You know, you wanted R&B and, and hip hop and you know what I'm saying? So now we're on the phone talking about the party and what type of music I want. Yeah. Um, but the phone conversation just started going left and we, <laughs> we ended up finding ourselves just talking on the phone for hours. Like, like I said, every time me and Jermaine came into contact, we would just click. It was just, I don't know. Instant, instant. But instant. Let me but ask I, you, let me ask you real quick. I'm sorry. Wait. What was you thinking in those moments? I was just like, well, phone. I already thought you were cute. But I was just like, man, Jarvis's friend is really cute. That's that was my initial thought, and he got good energy, and it's just really easy to talk to him. That's what I thought. Like, it was just so easy to talk to you. I thought that you was really beautiful. I thought you were uh, really cool, man. Like, really cool to be around. And yeah, we just always just clicked. You know what I'm saying when it came yeah. to the conversation. So yeah. So I wasn't really looking for anything at the time. So it was just, I don't know. In my head, it was just left at that. Yeah. But so now getting to the cabin party. Hey, that cabin party. Hold on. Let me, let me say that right now. <laughs> cabin party lit. Epic party of the year. Lit. Hey, that cabin party was lit, but I had that thing. Boop, 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 boop. Hey, everybody was up in there getting it, boy. Yeah, right. it was lit. It was lit. It was a time. A time to be 22. A time to be alive. <laughs> boy. All right, so boom. When me and my boys arrived, you know what I'm saying, we pulled up, you know what I'm saying, like two cars deep, you know what I'm saying. So we pulled up. I walk into the cab, and I'm like, oh, snap. Oh, oh this nice lit. Cabin. I'm like, yeah, this lit. You feel me? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Your boy on the music. So anyway, um, nobody's there to greet us. So we just walk in, you know what I'm saying? And there's like a balcony when you walk all the way to the end of the uh, the the house or whatever. So we're walking. I get to the balcony. I look over. I'm like, dang. Oh like, wait, you didn't tell them. You didn't tell them about how when you were on the phone with Ja and you was like, it'd be funny if one of us show up and uh, yeah, me find and our I, wife. Yeah, I, so I said that. I said, man, it'd be crazy if one of us find our wife, bro. How ironic is that? Yeah, Literally not knowing, into existence. not knowing it would be me. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> All right, so when I came in, I had walked to the balcony and I looked over and it was a lot of girls down there, you feel me? But I saw this chocolate one and she had, listen guys, she had wet and wavy hair. She had down to the blue rumper she the had on. The fact that she still remember is beyond me. Of course, of course. She had the blue rumper with the wet and wavy hair. She turned around, she was like, Oh, hi guys! Like that. And I'm looking like, dang, that's Mila? And remind you at the time she she had she had them braces in her mouth. She just uh I was like, Lord, 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 she's just beautiful. So y'all yeah, gotta understand, from 2017 to 2018, it's been a full year. I haven't even seen Mila. So when I pulled up, you know, she was looking all good. She was the birthday girl. And it just, at the time, also, I had a girlfriend back then. Now I don't have a girlfriend. So now I wasn't, you know, I wasn't checking for it back then, but now it's different. <laughs> and I'm just seeing her in a different light. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm not going to lie. Like, we was just vibing. We was dancing. And um, it, was, it was a good time that night, you know. It was a whole vibe, bro. Like, it was epic. Yeah, and when he showed up, too, I was like, this man is fine. <laughs> I was like, this man is so fine. Like the whole night was just a vibe completely. And we were pretty much just checking for each other the whole night. I'm just getting straight to the point. Like, what? You don't oh, sit here and say you wasn't checking I, for me? No, 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 no. You're right, baby. You're right. I just thought about like a couple moments too. I want to put this in there. We was we was hanging out at the hot tub late at night. It was just in the, we was in there <laughs> chopping it up, talking. Yeah, we um it was i forgot to tell y'all she had like a little guy that she called herself you know what i'm saying liking and she invited to the cabin party at the time and you know i caught myself being a little jelly you feel me so i a ended little up jelly he was so mad that i was i was a like, little jelly so i ended up like kind of like like man i'm out of here bro so i ended up 
going to a different room and I was just kind of like chilling in there. I laid down and stuff. I was just cooling, you know what I'm saying? As the night's going on, you know, everybody's having a good time, vibing, chilling, whatever. And then I noticed Jermaine is just gone, like just disappeared. So I'm thinking he's ducked off somewhere with a girl. I don't know why I'm concerned, but I'm concerned. So I go looking for him. Not obviously. I don't make it obvious that I'm looking for him, but I'm like checking around the cabin, trying to see where he's at. She was investigating, guys. <laughs> and so I go downstairs, and this man is in the room by himself, almost asleep. He's just cool. laying there chilling. And I don't know why that was so attractive to me. I don't know why. I guess maybe because I thought he was like with a girl or something. I don't know. But he was just in there chilling by himself. And so I was like... Are you okay? Is everything okay? So I came in there to check on him and yeah. I was like, I was like, yeah, bro, I'm straight. <laughs> you feel me? I'm straight. She came in and I actually was thinking to myself, like, what? Like you came and looked for me? Like it's a whole party going on upstairs. You yeah, come and make sure for my me? guest was okay. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but you know, honestly though, I really thought that was cool, you know what I'm saying? And I was like yeah, yeah, I'm straight down here and, you know. And we just stay down there talking for hours. Yes, we just stay down there talking and stuff. So we were downstairs kicking it and talking, you know what I'm saying? And we were just vibing and stuff like that um, for a, a good little minute. And then out of nowhere, we just cuddling. I forgot but, about the whole party going on upstairs. Yeah, you <laughs> feel me? We down, like, we was cuddling. But that was the most, that's the most we, we did and um but in that moment Jermaine was trying to go further no no well, no, no, no no don't do me like that no no but in that and moment I was like though, no like, <laughs> <laughs> well, no, no, in that moment though in that moment though I will admit that when I was holding her it felt like a missing puzzle piece that was found he always says that y'all it I'm telling you like like it felt right it felt really good like felt really mm -hmm. right like she just fit me like you know it's like the missing piece of me and i'm like what the world and we just lay there in silence yeah just feeling like i was just feeling his heartbeat and we ended up just like all right let, let's get back up to the party you know what i'm saying and then we just went back up there and was just dancing bobbing but now playing games you know I'm what i'm saying oh no you good no i was gonna say but now that's in my head all night like Dang, I really like Jermaine. Like, you know, we both we both was thinking that. Like, dang, I like me, you know. And uh, and let's just say, fast forward after the cabin party, we never stopped talking. We never stopped talking. Like, we it had was each just, other's phone number. Yeah, from from you know DJing and getting music. So we just just. I mean, he talking. called me immediately after the party, y'all. Immediately, I'm talking like right when I got home from the cabin. He calls me. Listen, and we listen. stay on the phone for hours. This girl had my heart. You feel me? I ain't even know it yet. I'm like, dang. <laughs> we stay on the phone for hours and hours and hours just talking. You know how we, when you're like having a good conversation, you just walking around. <laughs> you just lay on the floor doing all kinds of stuff. I was like, wow, I can talk to this man for hours. Like every time we connected, every time we linked, it was it just always has been that way. And also too, on my end, my mom was like, who are you talking to? You, you smiling too much. What's going on over there? You know, I like, I was like, man, like, mom, watch that, mom, like, I'm trying to talk, mom, you know, mom, like, what's going on? Like, mom, you know what I mean? You know, just, you know, I walk around, pacing around a lot, you know. Yeah, after the cabin party, we just continue to talk on the phone. We continue to just get to know each other. Now we officially kind of know that we like each other. So yeah. we're doing a little bit more flirting. Um, and then one night, Jermaine pops up at my mom's house. Because that's where I was staying at the time. And it's like 9 or 10 o'clock at night. And matter of fact, I was asleep. He calls me. He's like, hurry up. Come downstairs. I got to talk to you. And he knew to do that too. Because he knows that. If he would have called me when he, when he was at home and told me, like, can we meet up? I probably would have said no because it was late. It was late, yeah. And so, yeah, he calls me while he's outside. So, I'm thinking something's going on. So, I'm waking up all disheveled, trying to get myself together, hurrying up and putting something on. I run downstairs. 
and he's like, I have to talk to you. I have to talk to you. So I go downstairs and he's just smiling and I'm like, he's he chilling. I'm like, what's, where's heart. the emergency? Yeah. Like, what's wrong? You woke me up to come outside. Like, what is wrong? So I'm going to take over. Look, so, <laughs> so I, I, you know, she came downstairs, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh man, like God spoke to me. God told me certain things, you know, he showed me certain things, like, and she was like, what? What's going on? And I was like, man, I was like, man, God showed me certain things, da, da, da. and she was looking at me like, what's going on? And I'm like, bro, like, bro, I see you in my future, bro. Like, we supposed to be together. And she looking at me like I'm He's crazy. He's telling me he sees the white picket fence, the white me picket being fence. his wife, and I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. chill. Like, you're me. moving too fast. <laughs> I'm like, yo, I'm telling you, like, what's going on. Like, God showed me what was going on, you know what I'm saying? So, I was just so excited to, to share that with her, but... Yeah, she was looking at me like I was crazy. Like, I uh, really was. This man falls too quick. <laughs> He's a lover boy. That's really what I thought. You know, but here we are. <laughs> here we are. Here we are. So, <laughs> looks like I was right. You feel me? <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Thank you. So, yeah, I thought he was crazy, but I was like, eh, whatever. I still think he's cute. I still like him. I still want to talk to him. Yeah. So, <laughs> the girl, look, listen, listen. So, uh, we, we stayed talking or whatever. It was, you know, continuing to get to know each other. But we ended up, I, it didn't take me that long to know what I wanted. So your cabin party was in May of 2018. And in June 2018, I asked. So literally the next month, I asked her to be my girlfriend. Nice and um, and then July of next year, July 5th, we ended up getting married. So about a year or whatever but you know? may of next year is when he proposed, proposed to me so yes. yeah may the next year 2019 he proposed and then oh, excuse me yeah and then july we got married officially, yep. officially. and now we're here yeah. still rocking <laughs> I mean, when you think about it, our timelines was so it was short. Like, it was like, it's like, bang, 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 bang. You know. Wow, it did not take us long at all. Mm -mm. It didn't take us long. No, I, I listen, listen. I already know I came in with a mission. Listen, <laughs> it was a short span. God knew we was on a mission. So, you know, he's like, he's like, all right, we're going to have to speed this up. Da, 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 da. All right, send you back out there. <laughs> Go back over the road. So, you know, yeah. and here we are, you know. I think it's so crazy how it was like a full circle moment. Like you were out there on the road. You came. It was. It really seemed like you came back in town to pick up your wife and, and get go. back on the road. And that's, that's what it seemed. And, like. and God was like, "Look, he need his other half." <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Need you go ahead and get her and come on back out here. You know. So. But yeah, y'all. That is a story about how I met my baby. Yeah. We hope you enjoyed this vlog. We just want to say we love y'all. Thank y'all for being here. Um, and y'all, guess what? We just hit 19K on here. Woo! Gang, gang, gang. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is so surreal for us. God is just doing his thing on our social media platforms. We're really almost is. at 50K on IG. Make sure y'all follow us on there if you're not. Y'all, so, man, y'all already heard the story, man. Y'all already know what's going on. You feel me? Hey, look, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Let us know what y'all think. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We like we love to hear from you guys and um <clears throat> yeah I think that's about it man so that's about it I ain't gotta go home but you, but you can't, can't ride, ride with us, with us.